by covering education for you now. It happens in every school, elementary through college. Kids are bullied. But this evening, one area high school is coming up with a program that will nearly wipe that out. In honor of Bullying Prevention Awareness Month, we're taking a closer look at this issue, and RTV6's Ann Kelly has a story tonight. It makes a difference. Stacy Embry has taught English at Lawrence North High School for eight years now and says in the past few, a big change has taken place. You can see the kids interacting the hallway differently. Take student Matthew Tavel, for example. I'll see someone in the hallway crying and I'll start, hey, do you, are you okay? Do you need some help? It's a new mindset of checking in on fellow students, some of which are bullied, who might need a shoulder to lean on. And Embry says it came about thanks to a student group here called Character Crew. These are teens choosing to step up. They've joined the club, essentially saying they will be more mindful when it comes to what's happening with their classmates. And if they see someone who needs help, they'll get them to an adult. If there's someone who's sitting alone at lunch that you know looks like they would want a friend, we go sit by them. About a month ago, a kid said, I had three different character crew people come up and ask me to eat lunch with them. And it's not just character crew. New this year, Lawrence North with another outreach group all about providing support to students. And that group, it operates right here out of the women's restroom. This one says, to exist is to change, to change is to mature. Lucy Aspling showing our cameras the idea behind To the Girl. While character crew helps kids as they're being bullied, to the girl reaches out to them here when they're seeking refuge, providing messages of support to show girls they're not alone. I know that I've even come in the bathroom and I read the message that we write and it's really sweet to read those and it's really helpful. It's just nice to know that there are groups that will listen to you and help you out. Ann Kelly, RTV6.